डाउट्स में अटकते सब्जेक्ट्स में लटकते कब तक हम रहेंगे सर पटकते अब वेदांत तू देगा प्रॉब्लम से छुटकारा हाय के समझ हाय मायगा तो मजा आएगा मजा आएगा तो समझ आएगा बढ़िया टीचर्स प्रॉब्लम्स चुटकी में सुलझाएंगे डाउट्स सारी जिंदगी से आज आई गॉट योर डाउट दिस इज योर आंसर समझ आएगा तो मजा आएगा मजा Vedantu learn live online to attend a free live class download the app now Hey kids welcome to the dhamakedar farratedar and absolutely mazedar session of Vedantu young wonders because as i say every child is special whether you be in any corner of the world or of india for us all of you are extra special and extraordinary and that is why we come up with such extraordinary sessions for you every day to help you be better citizens of the country and as i always say leave the earth a better place than you had got it so with that we begin this good and great topic for the day whether you feel sleepy while studying now honestly let me tell you that even i felt sleepy while i used to study but then i followed some tricks some tips which i will be sharing with you today that you don't go through what i did in my schooling days so ready let us begin this is our amazing telegram group which you can join and learn more from us connect with us and know more about vedantu young wonders all you have to do is download the telegram app type vedantu young wonders on the search engine and there you are you are connect with us with us in a jiffy to enjoy our amazing sessions do not forget to hit on the like button share button subscribe button and hit the bell icon so that you get to know when we come online so subscribe to vedantu young wonders right now along with that what you have to do is you have to download the vedantu app so that you get to know about all the live classes all the mock tests live tests and learn from us live on the vedantu app so download the app right now and to know more to what vedantu does we conduct a lot of classes which are available for all of you at a very very cheap rate and jaisa ki main hamesha bolta hu isse sasta aur acha koi nahi de sakta ye meri guarantee hai so for that all you have to do is type vdnt.in/ytmicro in google and use my personal code that is prmic and get a 95% off 95% off kaun deta hai batao mujhe and if you want to learn an amalgam of courses you can take the vedantu pro lite subscription in which you'll get to learn a you know a combination of multiple chapters you can learn about the competitive exams in you can solve in class live doubts unlimited in number all you have to do is if you are in grade 6 this is the uh, link for you grade 7 grade 8 all you have to do is again use my code and you will get courses that cost 22500 Just for rupees ten thousand one hundred and twenty-five, itni cheap deal. Isle me khetta hu. Isse sasta aur acha koi nahi dega. So use that, take the benefit and learn, evolve and grow better every day with Vedantu. Ghar ka app hai, ghar ki company hai, ghar ka channel hai. Ham sab ek hi family ke hain. So join the family. Let us make it bigger, better, stronger with every passing day. So join us today. So let us begin the session that why do we feel sleepy while we are studying or are you feeling sleepy while you are studying there are some tricks and tips explained in this session of the day please watch it please follow it and let me know in the comment section whether you have benefited from it or not so let us begin keep your study room well lit now kids it's a very basic and simple psychology when you are sitting in a dark or a dim lit room you tend to feel sleepy that is the reason why we are about to sleep at night we switch off the lights hum kyu lights off karte hain because agar light padegi aankhon par to hum hum soenge kaise aur agar padte waqt light nahi padegi aankhon par to yahi hone wala hai और हम ये नहीं चाहते हो इसलिए मेक श्योर दैट वेर एवर यू आर स्टडी योर स्टडी रूम इज वेल लेट वहां पे अच्छी ब्राइट लाइट आ रही है डोंट यूज डार्क कलर्स ऑलवेज गो फॉर व्हाइट और यू नो ब्राइट येलो लाइट्स दैट कीप यू अवेक दैट कीप यू अलर्ट सो मेक श्योर दैट योर स्टडी रूम इज वेल लेट जस्ट लाइक दिस 
your study room should be well ventilated when you are in a closed environment where there is no flow of fresh air you tend to feel drowsy you tend to feel lazy and sleepy and we don't we don't want that to happen so make sure that the windows of your study room are open if you have a fear of mosquitoes to come in you can have a mosquito net if it's very hot you can have a you know a fan or an ac on but make sure there is some flow of fresh air coming fresh oxygen reaching you so that you stay alert and you stay completely awake while you're studying along with that always sit on a chair and not on a bed now kids again it's a very uh, basic body need if you're if you're sitting on a very soft and comfortable chair you tend to feel lazy you tend to feel sleep and aisa lagta hai ki ab baithe hain to thode pair bhi lambe kar le pair bhi lambe kar liye to hum bhi lambe ho jaye aur hum lambe ho gaye to ye nahi hona hai isliye you sit on a chair Preferably sit on a hard surface, not a very soft cushiony surface, so that you don't fall asleep, you don't feel lazy. If you are sitting on a hard surface, you will be uncomfortable, and obviously you cannot sleep when you are uncomfortable. So this uncomfortability will help you to stay alert, will help you to stay awake and study better. So make sure you sit on a chair and not on a cushion, just like this little boy is doing. Other than that, avoid a heavy meal. If you now again, there is basic. science behind that if you eat a lot if you have had if you have had a heavy meal what happens is i'll tell you if you have had a heavy meal <clears throat> the blood in the body the blood in the body it goes towards your stomach to help you digest all the food that you have eaten so the energy of the body is utilized towards digesting the food that you have eaten so the energy reaching to your brain will reduce and when the level of blood or energy reaching to the brain reduces obviously your brain tends to sleep and thus you also sleep so make sure that you have not eaten anything very heavy before you are sleeping make sure you always keep some snacks like i said in my one of the sessions make sure you keep a bowl of roasted peanuts or almonds or cashews or you know some fruit fresh fruits are the best option so make sure you have that and you don't eat something very heavy just before you are about to sit to study because if you do that you will feel drowsy you will feel lazy we have a scientific explanation for that here apart from that let us see another tip is that you drink lots of water again kids this is a very nice technique whenever you're feeling sleepy and you don't want to feel you don't want to fall asleep make sure you that you drink water because when you drink water there is some activity that happens inside your body and you tend to become awake and alert so drink water when you're trying, when you're you know when you're falling asleep or you don't want to sleep and you're studying keep a nice bottle of fresh water next to you keep on sipping that water so that you don't feel asleep and obviously जो हम बचपन से करते आ रहे हैं अगर बहुत ही ज्यादा नींद आ रही है कि अब पानी से भी काम नहीं चल रहा है जस्ट गो टू योर वॉशरूम जस्ट स्प्लैश फ्रेश कोल्ड वॉटर ऑन योर फेस एंड यूल बी अलर्ट दिस इज अ वेरी नाइस टेक्निक फॉर पीपल हु वॉन्ट टू वेकअप एट फोर ए एम देर आर पीपल लाइक नरेंद्र मोदी एंड यू नो वेरी सक्सेसफुल स्पीकर एंड अदर्स हु वेकअप एट फोर एम इन द मॉर्निंग इट इज नॉट दैट ईजी देर इज यू नो आई वुड लाइक टू टेल यू दैट देर इज एन एंटायर क्लब नोन एज द फोर ए एम क्लब दीज आर हाईली सक्सेसफुल पीपल हु वेकअप एट फोर ए एम इन द मॉर्निंग एंड स्टार्ट देयर डे एंड देर दे हैव रियली रीच डिफरेंट लेवल्स ऑफ सक्सेस इन द वर्ल्ड एंड दे हैव मेड अ नेम फॉर दैम so these people what they do is <clears throat> immediately after you get up from the bed just go and stand in front of you know just go and stand below the cold water shower once you do that when the when this cold water hits your body immediately each and every cell in your body becomes awake now i know it is not advisable for you guys i i'm not telling you guys to do it i'm just telling you that when you are feeling sleepy all you can do is splash cold water on your face and you will be alert because cold water tends to make your body cells awake and alert so whenever you're feeling sleepy either drink water drink fresh water or if it's too much just splash cold water on your face and you should be fine let us look at the other tip is that follow early to bed early to rise now kids again what i would like to tell you here is that if you uh, have your exams and you are about to you know stay awake till late at night uh, to write the exam tomorrow morning it's not a very good advice which i would ask you to follow what i would recommend is sleep early wake up early in the morning if you have too much syllabus left to complete wake up at around 4 three of that uh, you know for that sake i would tell you my incident you won't believe but this is the fact when i was 
taking my pre-boards when I was in grade 10. I used to sleep at 10 o'clock at night and I used to wake up at 3 a.m. I was staying in a hostel so I could not just wake up and you know switch on the lights. What I used to do is I used to wake up, I used to take a bath, I used to change in my, I used to wear my school uniform, I used to go and sit in the staircase because those lights would be open throughout the night. I used to sit there and study and I really passed my board exams with very good marks. So this is because what happens is when you wake up from a sleep, your brain is like a blotting paper. Blotting paper is something that absorbs ink. So your brain is like a blotting paper. Whatever you put in it, sorry, put in it for the next two hours, it will absorb and it will retain. So rather than waking up till night when you have stayed awake from morning till night, you have taken in so much of information, your brain doesn't hold the capacity to put in more information. But if you sleep for six hours or seven hours and you wake up, your brain is fresh. The blotting paper is completely empty and then whatever you'll feed, it will absorb. So rather than you know, staying awake till late night to study, wake up early in the morning. Compensate for that by waking up early in the morning and you will really see that your brain is able to absorb better, retain better and you are able to perform better. So early to bed, early to rise, make students healthy, focused and wise. So follow that and you'll definitely see a difference in your performance in exams. Along with that, keep your body parts alert and awake. By that, what I mean is always make sure that whenever you're sitting to study, your back is completely straight. It should be completely straight because when your back, when your vertebral column is straight, the amount of oxygen and blood reaching the brain is the maximum. And when the oxygen and blood reaching the brain are at its peak, your brain is very alert and awake. So make sure that you're sitting straight. Make sure your head, your neck is straight. Do not study for this for so long. Keep your books at a uh, good distance from your eye the book should be at a good distance and make sure that you are studying with your neck and back completely straight that will help you to study better retain better and absorb better so yes another thing is that always read aloud if you're trying to you know if you're about to fall asleep or if you're feeling drowsy when you're studying just read aloud whatever you're studying <clears throat> Again, I had discussed this in the memory hacks also. When you read aloud, what happens? Your ears listen and your brain also listens. So it helps to retain better. Remember, if you have not, please watch my session on memory hacks in Vedantu Young Wonders. It will really help you a lot. So exams are coming up. All these sessions will really help you. So make sure that you are reading aloud while you are studying, which helps your ears and the brain both to listen and retain better. Along with that, learn by writing. Again, in my memory hack session also, I had spoken something about notes and how they help, how visual learning helps more than reading. So if you write while you are learning, it will help you to retain better because when you are writing it, your brain is registering it along with your hands. And this will help you to remember your answers in the exam. So make sure that you learn how to make notes. Again, I'll be conducting a special session on how to make notes of the textbook so that you don't need to rely only on the textbook while you're studying. You read your notes, the last minute revision and you'll, able to be, you'll be able to score better. So learn by writing. And I think the other very important topic that I would like to tell you here is avoid studying difficult topics at night. So if you are about to sleep and you felt like Sony se pehle ek bar last revision kar le, don't do the difficult topics because there is maximum chances that you will forget it. So don't do the difficult topics. Do the most easy ones just last minute ek bar, you know, when you just have to scan through the pages. Do that. Difficult topics, keep it for the early morning. So we discussed that why we Waking up early will be helpful. It will be helpful because of this. Because when your brain is completely, the blotting paper is completely empty. When you feed in the difficult topic, it will absorb it and you'll be able to retain it. So with that, we come towards the end of this amazing and a very, very informative session. Do not forget to connect with us on the Telegram group where you can ask us for more tips where we can also help you with the diet, with what books to study, what books not to study, how to study and also guys, I'll be making a special timetable for each one of you on the Telegram. So for that, you have to connect with us on Telegram. For that, you have to, you know, message us on Telegram 
and let us know what help you need from us and i promise you that we'll always be there to help you so do not forget to like share and subscribe to vedantu young wonders because no one will do so much for you guys you are extra special extraordinary for all of us so do not forget to like share and subscribe to vedantu young wonders connect with us and make this family bigger stronger better with every passing day with that this is pritesh signing off for the day i'll see you on next thursday till then take care bye and god bless you all